Hello guys, Brian the Freedian here. So today I'm in front of this open air folk art gallery which is called the Bowling Ball House. So this is a Sydney Harbor, Florida and it is the home and studio of two well-established artists, uh, Todd Ramquist and Kiera Linda. So Kira Linda is one of the one name, so that's that's the name of the artist, and she goes by that one name. But anyway, they have this house here in City Harbor, Florida. It's right off of Third Avenue. But anyway, it's it's just like a, like an open air art gallery. Their whole yard is basically an art gallery, including inside the house. But I believe they're closed inside, so we're gonna just take a look on the outside. But they spent about they spent about thirty years, thirty plus years. Um, creating this this folk art gallery outside and it's got basically a lot of mirror fragments it's got definitely bowling balls uh, bottles beads it also has a bunch of uh, tiles and glass so guys follow me let's go check it out So there's another, there's a, a little sign on the front of this house which talks about different art classes and stuff like that, uh, summer camps, and there's some brochures here too. Let's see, this is the front of the house, so we're going to be walking through the front yard, and there is a little free library here, you can pick up a free book. Let's see if there's anything here. And there are plenty of books in there. There's like some necklaces right here, hanging right here. And this is the front entrance to the yard. So a couple little statue, little joker statues there. Little glass globes up there. Well, look at the uh, artwork here in the yard. Look at that um, same little tile floor there with the glass fragments and everything like there. Some bottles right there. So 30 years it took to create all this artwork here. And this is a peace and love little outdoor shack right there. Some cool looking chairs. Little disco globe right there. A few of them actually right there. Looks like they have some things. This is probably the outdoor art class where they have the art classes here. Looks like a bunch of candle holders right there. And that is pretty cool. Look at that glass, stained glass back there. Alright, so this is just one part of the backyard, or our, should I say front yard, there's some bowling balls right there. So I believe Todd Ramquest is basically one of the uh, artists here, that he, and his specialty was the bowling balls. It's pretty cool, look at that. A little bottle tree right there. 
And look at these bowling balls right there. That's pretty cool. Along the pathway. Yeah, I think that's private. We can't go in there, but lots of glass up there. So pretty cool looking place. A little fountain right there too. Got your little deep diver mask right there. Hot tub back there. So keep in mind this is a private residence, so they the artists live here, so you know, so they lived in this house, but there's the bowling balls along the flower bed right there. It's pretty cool. Little glass plants right there. And there's a sitting area there. <laughs> and this is Mer there's Miss Floridian right there. Miss Brian the Floridian. Here's Miss Holly. Here's Miss Holly. And she is relaxing in She's the relaxing. outdoor garden with that fountain in the background. So, so that's very pretty. relaxing. So pretty here. Isn't it? There's some more bowling balls right there. Another bottle tree. So anyway, let's go take a look around this out other part of the yard. There's a little bike wheel with some Looks like some uh, shredded tin can artwork on there. So the house is pretty decorated. Look at that. Looks like a bunch of tin can artwork right there. Alright, so this is the yard. We're, actually, we're walking along the side of the house. But there's a bunch of bowling balls right there. Looks like a few plants right there a little bit of termite activity going right there All right, so bowling balls and look at the outside of the house really beautiful the glass and the pieces of um, tile right there. Let's see another bottle tree right there. Pretty cool. Oops. A little ball right there. There's a lot of bowling balls in this yard. Actually, let's go around this way. And this is the corner of the house. I believe the back of the house. A lot of palm trees here. Another fountain. Let's see, bowling balls right there. Oh, guys, one thing to check out look at this chimney right there. It's got some. Sculptures on there with some tin can flowers, a bunch of little artwork up there. Another bowling ball. So I'm thinking this is the back of the house. Let's get out of that light right there. It's like some the sun sculpture right there. So it's pretty cool throughout here. This is also called the um, Whimsy House, as well as a bowling ball house. But 
I think it goes by whimsy on their website. And they have a website too also for this place. A little bird cage with a little chandelier in there. That looks like another sculpture right there too. Alright, look at that bowling ball right there. It's cracked. Ugh. So this is a lot of bowling balls they acquired. I wonder, wonder how many bowling alleys that they scoured to find these bowling balls. But here's a little boat with bowling balls in it. Pretty cool. There's the... edge of the yard right there. There's some, looks like some bottle flowers there made out of bottles. Yeah, more bottles right there along the flower garden there. Another bird cage, pretty cool. Lots of palm trees right here too. So we're gonna walk through here the sculpture right there. All right, it's a jungle in here for sure. Yeah, I didn't see that earlier. There's an angel right there too. And it looks like a crab right there. And look at this thing. This thing has all kinds of buttons and little pieces of glass and tile on there. Pretty intricate um, sculpture right there. Let's walk around this way. And I think this is the last part of the house. Little tiki warrior right there. And this is the whole, fr whole front yard, I'm going to say. There's a chicken right there, too. Laying some eggs. Some globes right there. Little ram right there with some bowling balls and but bottles along the flower bed right there. And look at that dragonfly, that's pretty cool. There's another, looks like another sculpture right there. A little flower with a face on it. And let's look at this guy right there. It's pretty cool. Little rabbit right there. So even the fire hydrants kind of blended in with this front yard right there. And this guy's pretty thirsty, looks like. He's drinking from the... Is that a spigot right there? But they use resourceful a lot of, a lot of things here for this little house. Blowing bowling balls right there. So this is across the street from, the, from where we just came from, the house right there. And this, I believe, is part of, is owned by the artist right there. And I think you can stay here. I think you can rent this overnight or for a number of days, possibly stay here. Because I, I saw on the website that you can rent a room or, or part of the residence to stay here. And look at the logs right there. They're kind of painted right there. Pretty cool. That's a big moon with little stones and glass fragments on it right in the middle of the yard. Only as much as I dream can I be. So some words to live by. And look at that fountain right there. Looks like you got some figurines on there, some dolls. That's pretty cool. 
And this is the house right here. I think you can stay here. From what I, what I was seeing from the, the Whimsy website, there's a place you can rent for accommodations for overnight. I think this is the place right there. But plenty of seating right there. And there's some Christmas lights right there too. Little orange uh, picture right there on the side of the house. Little mural right there, and it looks like you have some bicycle artwork back back around this side here. All right, Mr. Frog is right there, guarding the entrance to the house. And this is a cool looking bottle tree right there. Look at that bottle tree. This is the side of the house right there. And there is a lot of detail in this glass right there that they put together. And check this out. Look at this Volkswagen. It's got little circuitry parts, computer parts on there. Little shells right there. Little keyboard right there too also. Pretty cool. CDs. Looks like a circuit breaker in there on the roof. Just a bunch of cool looking parts on this. And this is the other part of the house right there and there's a lot of detail. A lot of stuff on the front wall. All right, guys, that's it for the Bowling Ball House or Whimsy House. Pretty cool location here in City Harbor on 3rd Street North. So definitely check it out. And if you like this, like this video, hit like, subscribe, and I will see you guys later on the next adventure. Take care.